Hey guys, Lou here, Tiny Mountain Houses. I got another one I want to show you. It's our Lincoln Peak model. Um, this is an 18 foot uh, single loft unit. I don't know if you've seen it before. We have done another video on it prior to this one. A little bit different approach with the interior design. I shouldn't say design, the colors. Um, you note the barrel roof in this model. It is standard on this particular house as is a lot of the features I'm gonna show you. Um, this uh, Craftsman style door is, isn't that a cool color? That turquoise color. Now we can paint it pretty much any color that you want. Um, so it's pretty flexible in that respect. Um, with that, I say, come on in, let's take a peek. I think you're really gonna like this house. Hey, this is really cool, guys. You know, this is a quaint little uh, living room area. Now we've got it set up with a couple of barrel chairs in here and some decor items to kind of give you an example of what it could be like. But wait till you see the rest of this house. I'm gonna change positions with Nick here. So I want to point this out. You might want to stay right there, Nick, so you get a full view as we walk through. Now, you know, this is an 18-footer, as I mentioned, a single loft. And that loft is just deep enough for a queen bed. Now, um, you got a little room on the right-hand side. It comes almost to the end of the loft here, just over 7 feet by 8 feet in width here. I want to point out the kitchen and some of the things that we've done in here. Um, the... Uh, uh, black walnut butcher block chain rusty chain accents um, are standard in this in this particular model or lincoln peak um, we've got laminate countertops our typical uh, 24 inch deep stainless steel sink and we've done the of course uh, the uh, 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 gooseneck pull down faucet in here the two burner uh, glass top electric cooktop we can do a um, a, a lot of different types of cooktops in here if that's not your thing but no big deal that is standard under the counter 3.1 cubic foot refrigerator with a freezer i want to point out these cabinets now we've done a little different stain work on our alder shaker style cabinets and i think it turned out really nice don't you um, we've got these madura style um, satin nickel poles and as always you know we talk about this again and again um, the full extension ball bearing drawer guide, so you've got full depth drawers. So you've got the usage of that as storage all the way back, as opposed to some shallower uh, uh, styles of drawers. Beadboard, uh, interior walls, and we've done this really cool dark stain uh, window trim uh, and, 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 uh, um, and ceiling throughout this build. But look at the height of this ceiling. I mean, we are over 11 feet from the floor to the highest point of this barrel. And we're at 52 inches of headspace as you crawl up into the loft. And I'll get up there in just a second and you can really get a, a kind of a, a better idea of how much room that, that really represents. Um, as you take a look um, at the uh, dining area here, we have once again the black walnut uh, butcher block. Beautiful finish um, along with the rusty chain support and accent here i think gives it a real different flavor uh, from some of the stuff you might have seen from us in the past and by the way we can duplicate these finishes in any tiny, tiny mountain house so if you like them hey by all means you know let us know and we can do this in your tiny house um, taking a look at uh, the bathroom here i'm not going to walk in there i'm going to let nick walk in what we've done in here now this is a customer unit we're getting ready to, to, to actually deliver it uh, this weekend. And she asked us to uh, include a, a composting toilet. Now that is our separate model. Nice, efficient um, unit. I think it's one of the best ones in the market. Uh, we do a lot of these. Um, so, I mean, we do a lot of different types of toilets, whether they're incinerating, uh, composting, um, dry flush. I mean, there's, there's so many different options and we do them all in this particular bathroom you've got a 36 inch one piece fiberglass shower it'll last you a long time our little petite sink to allow enough room to navigate get around in the bathroom works very well with this bathroom and the configuration now this has a standard mirror above that um above that sink and we can of course option in a, a medicine cabinet if you'd rather but there you go this is standard um, and uh, we've enclosed the ceiling completely 
in the bathroom to minimize any issue of moisture intrusion up in that cavity. And as always, you always have a, an exhaust vent that, that vents to the outside uh, of our bathrooms. Uh, in this one, we've got two uh, LED slim lights uh, inside the ceiling for plenty of light in that area. And if I didn't mention it already, the pocket door. Real space saving. I mean, it takes, a, takes away a lot of that uh, extra space that a swinging door uh, uses. So it really works well uh, with a lot of our floor plans. Let's check out the lock. Pine ladder, dark stain to match the stain around the windows and the beams that I mentioned just a second ago. Now this is seven feet deep, just a little over and eight feet wide. We've got a queen bed up here and lots of headroom. I mean, that's the beauty of these barrel roofs. At 52 inches, this is over 10 inches in depth. Uh, in fact, I think it's almost a foot. Um, so it still gives you enough room to sit up. Uh, as the case in, in any sleeping loft built by Tiny Mountain Houses, we do at least one egress or emergency escape windows. In this house, we've got two, uh, plus a third window on the end wall, and they all open. And all the windows, by the way, come with screens. Um, so with that amount of headspace up here, you know, it really is a cute, usable area, um, as you can see. So here it is, our Lincoln Peak, 18 foot, seven by eight foot single loft, nice quaint bathroom and 36 inch shower and the petite uh, sink along with the uh, composting separate toilet. Um, under the counter, 3.1 refrigerator freezer. You got a cooktop in here, the stainless steel sink with a gooseneck pull down faucet. You know what I didn't mention were these windows. This is a custom window package in here. Um, these windows are 58 inches tall uh, and they, they, they're just, they're so fitting of this particular, in my opinion, design. Um, beadboard interior walls, uh, the Madura finish on the cabinet hardware, as well as the custom stain um, that we used on the cabinets themselves. I love this house. Um, you know, it, it, it works for a lot of folks. If it works for you, hey, let us know. We'd love to talk to you. Maybe it's not this particular floor plan. Maybe it's a customized version of this or any of our other floor plans that work for you. Let us know. We'd love to talk to you. We'll do a fabulous job with your build, um, and we look forward to hearing from you. Thank you so much from Tiny Mountain Houses and our team.